jumping into Transformers, did you pick the bigger franchise? Uh, well, I'm, I'm really not the one who kind of picks those things. I was I'm very, very grateful to be asked. And not only to be asked to be a part of the franchise, what I believe is a, a true shot in the arm. I believe fans of the franchise will love it, and I believe because of the way it's presented, so many new people will be introduced to the Transformers franchise. So I think it's truly what the whole group needs. I think it's what the franchise needs. People are going to love this movie. So Travis was throwing a lot of love at you, saying you brought, in addition to a lot of physicality, brought a lot of depth to the role. Tell me a little bit of who you're playing in this. Uh, Travis was kind enough to be very specific with what he wanted. Uh, we talked openly about what he wanted out of Agent Burns. A lot of the stuff that I want to tell you I can't because I'm sworn to secrecy, but it's um, it, it was a very new look that I could take. I've, I've been a really good guy for a lot. I've been a really naked funny guy for a lot. So this was um, a, a, a different take. So this is a, it's, it's, I was very happy and very eager to do it. And Travis was there to kind of guide me and tell me when was too much and when it was not enough. He is, uh, he doesn't give himself enough credit. He was brilliant in this film. And to be able to get him to create an environment where I can become hateful towards a stick and a tennis ball, like that's, that's true skill. He's very good at what he does. So tell me about working with Haley. What kind of comes to mind? Haley is a person who can, I had to be hateful towards the stick and the tennis ball. She had to develop a, a legitimate bond and relationship. That is a special type of performer. And on top of that, um, the things you'll, you'll never see are the conversations we had offset about her life as a musician, about her touring life, how she balances it. She's so young and so, she's done so much. And to be able to see her go out and make this thing come to life and then see the trailer, like it's really, really special. She's. She's a very gifted performer. What kind of advice did you give her when you had those conversations? Advice? <laughs> I just asked her how she's figuring it all out. No, it's, 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 we would compare stories and compare situations and just hearing her today. She flew in from Mohegan Sun, Connecticut last night. She's going to spend the night here doing Comic-Con. She leaves on a plane as soon as we're done to go to New Hampshire to do another gig. Like, that's, that's the WWE lifestyle. So I, I admire that. Like, it shows that she's driven, but it's not simply the grind. There's a real heart to her work, and you're gonna see it, and you're gonna love it. Want more extra? Hit the subscribe button and the bell, and never miss a video.